We've got a couple of projects along the Diamond Creek where we're working with Nilibik Shire Council, the local community and community groups to promote uh, and create awareness and education around the impacts of litter in our waterways and in turn that helps support the habitat for the platypus. With the platypus surveys that Melbourne Water has done, we've found that Diamond Creek has the highest entanglement rate with litter with our platypus populations. As part of the Litter Action Project, we worked with volunteers to, to run uh, litter audits in the area to find hotspots along the Diamond Creek and find the main categories of litter in these hotspots. And we found that there was a bin that was overflowing a lot. So we looked at installing a new bin that would reduce the overflow of litter. The Big Belly solar bin has a solar system that senses when the bin is 70% full, so it will notify us and then we can empty it straight away. It also compacts the rubbish as it's collected so that it can actually fit more rubbish in the bin and reduce the number of collections that we have to make. There have been no overflows of litter since um, the installation of the bin, which has been great. And it saved us during the lockdown period because we've had a huge increase of people in the area and the bin has been fantastic for that time. In Melbourne, we're, we're so lucky to have these fantastic waterways and open spaces that we can enjoy, whether it's to run or walk or, or get out to nature. And we can all do our part, make sure if we see litter, to pick it up and put it in the bin or if you want to do more you can join a community group or talk to Melbourne Water about the various programs that we have that enables you to improve the condition and health of our waterways.